calling this a weight loss breakthrough. It is a non-surgical approach. Look at this. Mm. You take a, a tiny balloon, you swallow it. Then it's inflated with saline. What's that, saline? saline? Saline solution inside your stomach. Stays there for maybe six months. Takes up a lot of space, so you eat less. And at the end of the treatment, the balloon is deflated and it is removed. We haven't got quite through to the end of the no, process it's, there, it's but gone. I think you get the point. Yeah. Joining us now is the president of Apollo Endosurgery, the company behind this. Dennis McWilliams is with us. Did I get, well, that's your video. Did I get it right? right? Sure. I think that's a pretty fair description of how Orbera works. Um, it's meant as a non-surgical option. Um, right now, patients have only really had two options, diet and exercise and very invasive surgery. Hmm. Orbera is meant to fit that gap in the middle, provide okay. a less invasive way for patients. No, to I actually swallowed this. I'm, I've got one in my Not head. inflated. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Uninflated. It's like a bowling ball. Perhaps. Right. So you, it's deflated. deflated. Is it really very small? It's very small and slender. It's inserted by a physician into your stomach under sedation. Okay. Um, it's filled up inside the stomach, um, and then uh, yeah, the patient has the balloon in for six so, months. Okay, so doctors visit, I yes. get sedated, they stick it down my throat, right. they inflate it Correct. whilst I'm under sedation, Correct. I walk away feeling less hungry. Within, within an hour, right. Have you got FDA approval? We are FDA approved, and uh, we've trained around 500 physicians around the United States now. How therapy. many people have got this as we speak inside them? Uh, around the world, we've treated over 200,000 patients. Uh, in the United States, we've already treated a few thousand patients um, and since the our launch. weight loss results? R results have been great. I mean, the uh, typical uh, patient will learn, lose anywhere from 20 to 40 pounds. Some people can lose even more than that. Um, it really depends also on the, the diet and exercise program that's around the patient as they have the balloon in. Um, what happens I, I, when you take it out? Yeah. What's the so, chance of you putting yes. the weight back on? Yes. So, right. so right. The, the studies show that people maintain the weight loss after the balloon is removed, but so much of the, the tool is used for to teach them new eating habits. You eat oh. less food, you're in a diet and oh. exercise program kind of through the program, oh, yeah. so when the balloon comes out, you have better habits. You are familiar with the study of what happened to the people on the biggest yes, loser. Yes, on the biggest loser, right. Because they all yeah. put it back on right. again because the body is telling them, put it back on. But at, surely the same thing would happen with but this. But at the end of the day, you know, any weight loss program, whether it's diet and exercise or invasive surgery, requires the, the patient themselves to be very committed to a program um, to change their, their diet and exercise. Uh, this is a tool. This so is a tool. it's still up to me. It's still at the end of the day. <laughs> this yeah, is a right. tool that helps you uh, along that way. No right. magic potion. There's, there's not a magic pill yet for obesity. One last so. one. Have you had any trouble with gastric ulcers because of the chronic irritation that these create? No, the, the rate of gastric ulcers is extremely low on that. Most patients will experience some nausea within the first week, but um, Orbear is very well tolerated, very safe and effective. Okay. Um, now, one last question. We are a financial program. Correct. I walk in the door of the doctor's office from soup to nuts, walking in the door to walking out with this thing in my stomach. How much? Typically six to eight thousand um, dollars. But if you weigh Jeez. that, but if you weigh that against the cost of the diet and the exercise program, um, and what we spend on those six things, six to eight thousand dollars. Steady, Stuart. Well, and the cost, you think about the cost of cardiovascular disease and diabetes and medication. Yeah. If you can reduce those, eliminate those. Um, it becomes very economical. Would insurance Are you a publicly <laughs> traded company? We're not. We're a privately traded mm, company right going now. Going public at some point? Uh, we, we aspire to that, but right now we're focused on our product launch. Dennis McWilliams, Apollo Endosurgery. Thanks right. for bringing Thanks it. Thanks very much. Appreciate it, sir.